time to send thoughts and prayers there. I'll be sure. R&B singer, a uh, real popular in the late 80s, singer, songwriter, guy who, uh, you know, was instrumental in some people's careers, had a little bit of a hand work, uh, with Joe to see, uh, had a hand with Tevin Campbell, uh, worked with Guy and Teddy Riley and Heavy D, et cetera. And, uh, and, little, and of course, the Secret Garden, you remember his vocal part. Well, he fell into a coma and, you know, got really sick, got induced and everything, and he's been on the road to recovery. And I saw an interview with him, um, talking about he working on a project, getting his health together, getting everything going. That's one thing with this pandemic, like the last few years, you got to take care of yourself. If anything else has been, hey, get yourself together, check yourself out, avoid that stuff you don't need, and just work on you, essentially, because... You know, that's what it comes bound to be about. And um, it's good to see that he's back about getting himself together and uh, thoughts and prayers are with him. And he's doing, you know, he did radio station work. He's done a lot of different things. Um, you know, it's been a real past tough few years for him. Loss of the mother of his child, Kim Porter. And, um, you know, just a lot of different things going on. But it's good to see that he is getting on the road to recovery. I just want to take the time to send thoughts and prayers at his role and to see that uh, people sending well wishes and getting back to, uh, you know, being productive. So thoughts and prayers are with Al. Be sure. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome on thoughts and comments, and I do respond to shit of it if you want to. And uh, beyond Al, be sure, just telling you in general, eat better, take care of yourself, because you never know, especially with everything that's going on health-wise. Health-wise, you better take care of yourself. Peace. I'm out.